If you're asked to factor the equation x squared plus 12x plus 20 equals 0, here's how you do it. So first off, we'll set up a skeleton equation. We've already done that here. Then we can add signs to our skeleton equation. In this case, we have a positive and a positive. So if all the terms are positive, we'll put a positive and a positive in our skeleton equation, like this. Once we've done that, we can find the factors for the last term. That's the 20, and those factors should add up to the middle term. So the factors for 20 are, and as I look at them, I can see 2 times 10, that gives me 20. 2 plus 10, that gives me 12. So I'll put a 2 here and a 10 here, and we're done. We factored the equation x squared plus 12x plus 20. We should check our work, though, with the FOIL method. We multiply the first, the outside, the inside, and then the last. And that gives us, and if we combine 10x plus 2x, we'll get the 12x. And we have our 20, we have x squared. This is what we started with. So we correctly factored x squared plus 12x plus 20. Let's take a moment and find the values for x. If we put them in the equation, it'll make this side equal to 0. 0 equals 0, that's a true statement. So we say x plus 2, that equals 0. Add negative 2 to both sides, x equals a negative 2. Over here, x plus 10, that equals 0. Add negative 10 to both sides, x equals negative 10. So if we put negative 2 in for x and we did the math, this side would all equal 0. Likewise, if we put negative 10 in for x and we did the math, this side would equal 0. If you use the quadratic equation, you would also end up with these exact numbers here. This is Dr. B factoring the equation x squared plus 12x plus 20. Thanks for watching.